Not many NHL players can say their home arena is within 30 kilometres of the home in which they grew up. Road trips aside, Jean-Gabriel Pajot's entire hockey career has been within a city bus distance. I was always uh, trying to get away from my parents, but I guess, uh, I guess it didn't work. Um, no, it's fun. I'm close with my family, my friends, my girlfriend. Uh, it's, it's fun to see them. I see them after games. Uh, I feel their support too, uh, all through the years. It's not always easy and they're always there to support me. Um, I don't take it as, as a pressure either. Uh, I really uh, feel it as a motivation and um, yeah, keeps my, my level of uh, energy up. The 23-year-old centerman grew up on the other side of the river where he quickly began to stand out as an elite player. Pajot moved quickly through the minor league system and eventually landed a spot on the midget AAA Gatineau Intrepid. In 2009, he was drafted to the Gatineau Olympic, where he spent three seasons before he was drafted 96 overall by the Ottawa Senators in 2011. I think I've been uh, here now uh, working out with Chris Schwartz for the, the past five years. Five years, so um, it, it's fun. I come here and we're a good group of guys, uh, lots, lots of pros too. So it's good to push that we can push each other. And uh, I think I was, I'm, I'm familiar with the area and and everyone here. So it's, it makes me more comfortable in the in the in the area. Last season, despite being a disappointing one for the entire organization, was Pajot's first full NHL season. He played all 82 games, recording 24 goals and 19 assists, and led the team in shorthanded goals. It's something that, that I take pride of, uh, playing on the penalty kill. Um, I'm happy to be uh, on, the, on that unit, and uh, it, it's uh, something that I want to keep doing. Uh, I think uh, my plan is to play defense first, then if the chance is there, for sure go. Uh, but last year uh, we were struggling, giving a lot of goals. Uh, so I think uh, this year we really want to defend first and uh, then go. So we'll see uh, what's going to happen uh, for the rest of the year. Now with the 2016 season barely off the ground, Pajot knows what he and the team has to do to improve from last year's disappointing finish. You always want to be consistent uh, in every aspect, is it uh, defensively and offensively. Uh, you really want to be consistent. I think uh, that was my main problem uh, when I was uh, a little younger in my career. Uh, that's something that I really worked on and I want to keep working on it. Thanks to veterans like Eric Carlson and Chris Neal, Pajot knows the right players are around to help maintain that consistency. When I first came in, well, there's always good leaders like our, like our captain, uh, Eric Carlson, I, I guess he learned that from someone else too. Um, close to from Chris Neal, he's, uh, he's always been a good leader. I worked out with him in the summer too. Uh, he shows me the, the right way, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll be a good pro and uh, I think they're all uh, good mentors. Uh, we still have a bunch of uh, good group uh, this year and good leaders for sure. It also helps when your team captain makes an effort to speak your native language. There's, some of them are even trying to learn, so uh, trying to talk to me. I know uh, Eric Carlson is trying, he's on his phone, uh, download his app, and uh, this happened, talking to me in French. Sometimes it doesn't make sense at all, but at least he's trying, and uh, I think it's, it's good uh, in the city uh, when you have, uh, you're just across the river and it's all French. Uh, I think it's, it's fun that, uh, that he's trying to, to learn the French uh, language. Now, with a full season ahead, Pajot says the team is ready to turn the page. We really want to, I think, all t turn the page. Uh, we want to. We learned a lot from last year, and uh, we want to go into this year uh, with a fresh start. Uh, we got new players, new coaching staff, uh, new systems. I think uh, it's it's a fresh start for everyone, and uh, we're all uh, ready to go and compete. Uh, we didn't make the playoff, obviously, last year. Uh, doesn't. We were all disappointed, but uh, I think uh, we're all on the same page right now, and we want to go uh, as far as we can.